Hi guys, I'm Ed, welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing a night sky bat inspired look for Halloween. So this isn't time for Halloween. Um, I'm going to show you how we did the eyes, what we use, everything else. So if you guys want to know how I did it, just keep watching. Okay, first steps, so obviously we're doing it on a different camera, different angles. I've got my mirror right in front of me here, um, just so you guys can see how we do this look. So camera's about to die so I'm just completely gonna leave that camera we're going to work on the phone um so quality is different sorry apologies first up after doing my brows so brow use the revolution brow pomade in medium brown really good one as you can tell I'm basically running out so I do need to get a new one second step is grabbing your base so you want your tacky base because you want everything shimmer <laughs> so hi I have the dog with me, I have Ben, who's in his bed sleeping, um, so peel his base for room number two. So we're just going to put it on the back of the hand, like so, and then I just use one of her base brushes, like so, and I just warm it up and apply it all over the lid. And I just kind of pat my lid just to keep it even soft. Um, so just grabbing a little fluffy brush and just gonna blend those edges like so. Always doing the front, blending up with that brow. And I just kind of pat on it. Just kind of like smooth it out. Okay, perfect. So the eye is looking a little bit like this. Just going to remove the rest of that off my hand. So we are going to go into the Beauty Bakes Nikki Tutorials palette, open it up and we're going to be using the first shade down here in Amsterdam. So that's our base colour. So what I do, I'm dipping in a Morphe E36 and just picking up that pigment, just keep prodding it in. And then what I do, I always go for the outer corner first. And I like to round it off first of all. And I'm just patting it literally on the eye. Having on a Halloween looks this month or this year. It's not really my thing, I've been really too busy. Trying to um, design my new desk. If you haven't seen, um, I, we do have another channel, so me and my partner have another channel, um, where we are currently converting a bus into an RV home. So we're quite excited. My desk is going to be, my room is not this big, not how big this is now. So I have to, to plan it. So keeping it patted in, following it through that crease. like so with the main product on that brush just gently circular motions fluff those edges perfect like so let's move on to the next shade pop on the brush down coming out of this palette stick them with beauty bay theme the beauty bay and mitchell so this palette right here and we're using morgan and some more, and I'm just tapping it on. I'm just ever so gently building up that pigment so it won't come up straight away, and we don't want to harshly put pigment down, but we also want it to blend nice as well. So, doing the outer corner first, it's okay to come lower down. And moving on more on the inner from side to side circling motions just like so so what you're trying to do is get the colors to seamlessly blend through and then you lighten everything up afterwards so you get this beautiful light eye 
pop that brush down. Just picking up a really, really fluffy brush. And I'm going to Mars High, just a light purple. And just again, starting up in that brown. So in your highlight spot, and I'm just gently setting this in blending. And don't worry if you blend over the top, because you want them to seamlessly blend the colours in together anyway. Get a beautiful eye. So I, I dip back and forth now. And let's focus on the front. Can you see where we are? We're matching up those colours. I kind of go lower down the crease and up. And that is that eye so far. So obviously it seems like it's a lot darker, but we are remember cutting that crease out. So all I do is I grab a pot of Vaseline. I dip a little cotton bud into it. And I make it my crease. And then the other side which is dry. Yeah, that takes it off for you. So just trying to match the same cotton pad. Just dry that eye. Don't say hi. Say hi. Hi. Now that is done. On that side. Picking up your Louise base in Blank Canvas X. I'm going to make sure they come out with some awesome stuff I tell you. And I just, just gently use a little bit. And now I'm going to pop that on the eye. So kind of get it where I want it. Take a while to uh, to get the crease perfect. Just drag out those edges so when we blend through, it sits together perfectly. Okay, perfect crease is done. So now I'm gonna dip back into Nikki's power, which I absolutely love. And this one here, yeah. all in. I'm just gonna use my finger. I just want to put that all over the lid. Again with the Morphe E36 and Amsterdam. And those together. I like to just grab a small brush and grab Amsterdam. Back over to make like a blue like liner. Like so all this draws and bats. Go with PS liquid eyeliner. This is by Primac. It's actually a really good liner. Royal and Lang Nickel. So a little I'm just gonna follow the same pattern from this eye onto this eye. My ears. Look how cute it looks. We'll look like this and draw like a little bird I mean like five and you're drawing this is what you do I'm gonna try and resemble a little bat down here cute I'm gonna go off camera now put some lashes on do the rest of my face come back with the final look see you guys soon Hey guys, welcome back. So lashes are on. Just put on 
one of my wigs. Just a beautiful ashy blonde silver wig. It's got a little fringe. This is the final look. This is it. This is my at night sky inspired look for Halloween. I hope you guys have enjoyed this quick little video on how to do it. I will link all of the face products of what I used um, in the description box down below. So if you guys want to find out what I did use for this, the face height, the lips and stuff, do check out down below. Yeah, this is it. It's super cute. I love it. I hope you guys have liked it too. <laughs> like a little, a little different. I really like it. But yeah, if you have liked this video, guys, then give it a big thumbs up. Do the usual subscribe, comment, and share. But I hope you guys have liked it. I'll see you guys soon. Thank you. Bye.